is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family, my mess. I know Baldur wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes, I do. There was another. Before Atreus? Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? I'm about to go off like a weapon. Fuel to the top, gotta fill the benches. In my thoughts, obsession. I will not stop, no, I'm never second guessing. It was long ago. Never mind. I shouldn't have asked. We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley, this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya. But it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is no peace I seek. All those times I found you. 
Why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. Seek with rays We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the grand hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. It's all so simple. Why did I have to come back here? And be reminded of all this. The grand hall. It's in ruin. May Freya never waver. The other half is missing. May she protect us always. An old adage, if you will. You can get through over here! <laughs> I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. Yeah! <laughs> 
isn't enough what Odin did to me. He's desecrated every memory I have of home. Be glad you have a home to remember fondly. In Sparta, we were taken from our homes as children and raised in the Agoyi. We marched though we drowned, fought for scraps or starved. Our elders beat us till we could not stand. At night, we made our way home, alone, or food for wolves. That is how Spartans are made. These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. Yeah! <laughs> well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. <laughs> Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. Disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to find at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion at the giants. It is one glory concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Ha! Well done, bro. Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. Can you swing that torch to the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path? Let's cross the bridge now. Oh. 
Of anyone alive, be squeamish about war. After all the cost you I have seen enough war to know the cost. After the price I paid to end one. Look around you, Sears. See what happens when you don't fight a tree evil. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. Unscutan Asgard! Pizza! Pizza! I am reaching my limit for enlightened platitudes from you today. Can you please just shut up and kill things?
Not tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me, and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. Let's go. It's just past those doors up ahead. There. I feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. Hold on. Something's not right. Opinbera. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Nepo! The creature! It belongs to Odin? No. It protects Yggdrasil's roots wherever they are. Master was counting on it. That's it! Don't relent!
can help you! I can handle the creature! Focus on the roots! I'm trying! Your timing's off! Can't you just chop its head off already? That is not helpful! Then do a better job distracting it! Parry that attack! Ah! 
It's over. It's, it's really over. And now that you have what you seek, I suppose. This is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. Have you decided? I can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry that it'll always be. It'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Look. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. 
not for that. I do not regret saving your life, and never will. But the choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice. But I am myself again. I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Let me live with that for a moment. We can take this way back to the camp. I can help with the vines. Now embed your blades into the glowing vines and light it. Your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to go back to how it was. Leaving the responsibilities of leadership to me. to use what you have. It's not as though I want to be angry with Freyr. He's my brother. He was the most important...